A local veteran from World War I was posthumously awarded a Purple Heart today, nearly a century after he earned it. Fox 11's Eric Peterson reports from Goodman, where the family of John Draxler accepted the honor. This is to certify. 96 years after being wounded in World War I, a Purple Heart was awarded. To Private John A. Draxler, American Expeditionary Forces for wounds received in action. John Draxler's two daughters accepted the medal. So here you are. Well, I want to cry, but I'm holding it back. Because <laughs> it's very moving to see everybody together. Draxler returned to Goodman after the war and would often tell stories to his grandchildren. He told us he had a, a tall gun with a big knife at the end of it. And he even showed us his, his scars on his leg from when he was shot. Bernie Draxler Lorich says her grandfather never got a Purple Heart. Awards weren't available until decades after the war. The family checked into Draxler's record and after months of searching. Thank you for, for, for your father's service mm -hmm. and, and here is the medal that he earned. I'm still shaking. Very proud to have known Grandpa and to be a part of his family. A rifle salute. and taps from another granddaughter, Joan Draxler Rupp. It was wonderful. It was an honor. It's probably the most meaningful thing you'll play on your horn. Family members say Draxler was a humble man, but he would approve. To have everybody come to honor him this way would have just been over the top, yeah. I'm just very grateful that everyone's here, and it, it couldn't have been a better day. In Goodman, Eric Peterson, Fox 11 News. Well, Draxler was very active in the local American Legion post. He died in 1974 at the age of 83. The Purple Heart will be on display at the Goodman Historical Society.